Hi all, Abe here. Welcome back to the channel. Here's hoping you and yours are doing well. Continuing our playthrough of The Outer Worlds, uh, we last left our hero at Scylla. We uh, ended up trying to finish another quest at Scylla, and uh, we did so, uh, recovering the shipment for the Doctor. Last episode, we picked up a couple of weapons. We picked up a, um, a couple of science weapons. We picked up a hammer and a uh, shrink ray gun. Uh, and uh, we also met up with Wells at his laboratory at, uh, well, it's an asteroid. It's called Phineas's Laboratory. <laughs> so, so we met up with him there briefly uh, before heading on to Scylla. Uh, because, well, when we got back to Groundbreaker to try to get the key to go into um, Stellar Bay, apparently I have to pay some amount of bits in order to get it. And I don't know if I want to do that. So I think I'm just going to go there and see what happens. It seems unlocked on my screen. So we're just going to go in and, and check it out. Um, and now we're back at the ship. And we're trying to determine what's our next move. Let's uh, let's pop in. Let's get into it. All right, we are back. We're back in it. Let's see here. Let's see what we have left to do on our oops, our journal. Okay, so we can go report back to the doctor at Groundbreaker. Let's uh, let's go ahead. That let's finish that off. So let's head, let's head back to Groundbreaker. Wow, that's a bit of a hike, isn't it? Let's go ahead and finish that off. The Groundbreaker has approved our request for docking, Captain. You're nice. free to disembark. Wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Do I have any other... Drinking Sapphire? Talk to Pravati on the ship. Oh, wait. Let's, let's do that. Let's talk to Pravati on the ship real quick. What's up, girl? Talk to me, girl. Hey, Captain. I hope I wasn't too much bother at the bar. I did have fun, and I tried some things I never would have otherwise. And I don't feel it today. Hmm. I guess that water must have worked. I'm glad I had you looking out for me. Glad to hear it. I wouldn't mind having a drink again. Someday. In the distant future. <laughs> anyway. I messaged June Lei when we got back, and she replied super quick. <clears throat> okay. I was awake half the night, thinking about what I sent, anxious to see what you said. I reread my message in the morning, and it was unclear. I was drinking when I sent it. Otherwise, I wouldn't have had the courage. Also, sorry for the typos. Okay, not bad so far. I've ruined things in the past. Because I didn't say things I should have, like, I've met someone who's become special to me. I want to be honest with her, so if she feels the same about me, there won't be any surprises. Wait, is she talking about you? I've got to read between the lines a bit, but <laughs> I think she might be. Yeah, I ought to go write her back. I mean, I already did. Mm. Twice. <laughs> but anyhow... Thanks for taking me out, Captain. You betcha, kiddo. Alrighty. Parvati's getting her romance on, which is always, well, always very nice. Uh, let me just double check if, if there's anything else. The Empty Man. This is a monarch. You know, we're going to go there next if uh, nothing else pops up on us. Let's take Ellie, because she's probably, you know... And let's take Felix. And let's let's go. Okay. Let us go. going to speak with Gladys. Is she on the passage to anywhere? Purchase the napkin to still away from Gladys. Okay, so I'm not going to buy her napkin. 
Screw you. Uh, where is the thing with the... Oh, here it is. Report to the doctor. Yes, we interrupted regular... Hey, hey! What up, Martin? Looking good there, buddy. Looking good. Hey, Doc. Well, well, Dr. Fenhill. It's not often I see you on this side of sick bay. I make it a point not to get shot, and when I do, I can usually take care of the mess myself. It'd be nice to have you in here patching people up, not just blowing them apart. I respect what you're doing here, but you know I'm not ready to settle down. It's not you, it's me. <laughs> have it your way, then. You always do. Now, about your friend here. Were I a gambling woman, I'd wager you're responsible for my mechanical safe return. I can't thank you enough. Sure you can. Sure you can. Level up. Let's see here. What do we got? Ten points? Alright, let's get some range in here. Let's get some handguns up there. Let's get that to minimum armor penetration damage. That looks like it's important. Let's actually look go for dialogue. I feel like I've been neglected in dialogue a little bit. Um, hmm. Let's go two points, two points, and no? Is, is that it? And leadership. Uh, okay, I think that's good. Apply. Accept. Oh, we got some perks. Let us take a look at the perks. Alright, so I have here... What are we going with? Ooh, bonus to dialogue skills when you have no companions in your party. That's unlikely. Consumable weight. This is what the... Now. Health restored per kill. Companion ability cooldowns for each of your kills. Chance to reset the companion ability cooldown now. Chance to reset it now. Reduce the penalties to accuracy when moving. That sounds nice. Oh! TTD sounds nice. Uh, extra headshot. Alright, so I'm going to go with the TTD restored per kill. I guess. I don't know. Do I have anything else for my fillers here? No, they don't have anything. All right. So we have that quest completed. Let's take a look at the the journal. Search for clues. Hawthorne's terminal mentions searching black market vendors at Groundbreaker and Fallbrook. Not sure where Fallbrook is at. It's probably in one of the other planets. And this guy still needs. Can't believe I. I I still have to go to Edgewater to finish that. Track down Reginald Cheney. All right, and he's in... Oh, he is in Fallbrook in Monarch. Okay, so both of those are in Monarch. Let's go to Monarch. And I refuse to pay this woman. I refuse. I'm going to take my ship there. We'll see what I find out. Because I remember an email from Udom Bedford that said that you could land on a field or something to that effect. Wait, I'm going the wrong way. Where am I going? Am I going the wrong way? Uh, no, I think I'm good. Um, I mean, I could be wrong. Is this the wrong way? This looks like it's definitely the wrong way. Oh, it is. It's definitely the wrong way. Man. Why don't you tell... Hey. What's popping? If you're hungry, you've come to the right place. I've got a fresh ground batch of Spratwurst cooking. They're terrified to lock in the juices. How about a grinder's dozen? Huh. What's Spratwurst exactly? You know what Sprats are. Space rats. <laughs> the laboratories of Spacer's <laughs> Choice found a use for this limitless frontier resource. <laughs> Sprat meat is plenty tasty when properly mm. prepared. We grind them up in sausages, then terror fry them in their own juices. <laughs> what does terror fry mean? Terror frying is a Spacer's Choice brand secret, a mix of 13 herbs and spices, 
plus a dash of modern chemistry. Mm. Is Spratwurst like Bratwurst? I've seen that a lot. Absolutely not. Spratwurst, in all related terms, are registered trademarks <laughs> of Spacer's Choice. Of course. Or the other meat is a registered trademark of CMP. Everyone knows our company and theirs are nothing alike. Clearly. Is Spratwurst your own invention or what? Legally, no. The terra frying method was developed and marketed by Spacer's Choice. Between you, me, and this grinder, I've been through lean times. If there's one thing you learn on tramp freighters, it's how to make near anything edible. Might be that this old space hand put a few words in the right ears, and could be that Spacer's Choice liked sticking it to C and P by R and Ding our own special meat. Okay. That's enough talk for now. Just as well. Near about time for me to go check on the trap. I mean, to unload <laughs> another crate of farm fresh sprats. Uh, <laughs> I'll just excuse myself. Thank you, darling. Okay, very charming woman. What's, what's, what is your problem? Don't look funny at the crew. Heard they toss folks out the airlock if they don't like your face. Really? Wow. You, what's your deal? Miss Lilia takes good care of us, see? The authorities stay off our tails. Okay. That's good. C and P chicken and potatoes. C and P chicken and potatoes. All right. Let's get back on the ship. And let us go to Monarch. You're <laughs> walking around with this humongous hammer. Freaking awesome. Okay. How many companion quests are there? Are they just one? Or are they, do they have like several? I don't know. Okay. Where are we headed today, Captain? The stars are the limit. The stars, eh? Well, Ada, today is your lucky day. Because today, against all odds, we are going to Monarch. Warning, dangerous. Cascadia landing pad. I don't care. That's where we're going. I am not paying for this freaking thing. Message from Dr. Wells. We'd like to congratulate you on finding a route to Monarch. Oh, thank you. Put him on screen. Cascadia is utterly seething with dangerous, highly aggressive creatures, more than capable of tearing you limb from limb. Wonderful. You'd have to be a lunatic to land in Cascadia, and I'm reasonably certain I tested your brain for incipient signs of insanity. Trust me, talk to Gladys Cult Kelly. Hmm. I'm going to fight my way overland to Stellar Bay. Tell me what you need. You'll need to speak with Hiram Blythe. He's known as the information broker, and for good reason. If anyone knows where I can find those chemicals, it's Hiram. I need those chemicals to revive the Hope's colonists. They can help us fight back against the board. They can help us set things right. If we don't put a stop to the board, they're going to drive this colony toward a complete societal collapse. You'll see what I mean when you arrive on Monarch. You sound like you've been to Monarch. <laughs> no, never. Monarch is a hotbed of political activity. I can't imagine why Hiram set up shop there. Cuisine, perhaps? Hmm. Where should I start? You'll want to hire the services of a skilled guide. I recommend a hunter by the name of Nioka. Frequents the drinking establishments of Stellar Bay. Very hard to miss. Once you have everything you need, make your way to Hiram Blythe's compound. Uh, I've got some questions for you. Come see me in my lab. I'll answer any questions you have. Ah, eh, boo. All right, I'm Best off. Best of luck. Everyone on the Hope is counting on you. Captain, an unusual wavelength is coming through Monarch's aether wave frequencies. Who? Oh? The Eternal is in us all. The OSI would have you believe that your place in society, indeed in the universe, is preordained. 
A man who works in the mines of Hephaestus, coating his lungs in mercury dust for not but a few bits a night. This fate is set in stone? When he dies young, coughing up black blood, his part in the grand plan? No, I say. Greatness is in everyone. Not just those so fortunate as to have been born into prosperity. That was unexpected and odd. Sounded like a bunch of nonsense, Ada. I am inclined to agree with your assessment. By which I mean I have been systemically programmed to do so. That's great. Let's talk about something else. How can I be of assistance? Okay. Let's see. Got a minute to talk? I have lots of minutes. Many minutes. Oh, I forgot this thing. Minutes, perhaps. Providing an adequate power source, I can function indefinitely. That's lovely. Uh, did I, I think I went through this already. Yes, I did. What if you don't have a power source? I prefer to think of it as being in a state of slumber, perhaps for an indefinite duration of time. Do you think that is what it's like for the colonists on A Lost Hope? I guess so. When I simulate myself in such a scenario, I do not find it to be desirable. I think... My self-preservation protocols incline me to desire the alternative. And what might that be? Traveling the system with you, Captain. Uh, okay. Alright, so I need to go back to... Can I go back to something that I said before or no? No, this is just tells me what I what I already talked about. All right. Um, that didn't help you last, Captain, much. I assure you, not for a lack of trying. Captain Hawthorne did not like to listen to my suggestions. In that way, he was a lot like you. Wonderful. As you may be aware, Captain Alex Hawthorne was a smuggler of some repute. I failed to predict the likely outcome of his reckless behavioral patterns. I should have predicted that. In our travels together, Alex liked to pass time by, as he called it, tinkering to improve my design. Oh. Uh, let's talk about something else. Let's talk about something else. How can I be of assistance? I want to know about Monarch, Ada. Where's the... Oh, here. I'd like to learn more about the colony. What part of the colony would you like to discuss? Um... Monarch. Where in Monarch? What? Oh, I don't know. We're in Cascadia, right? Well, let's go to Cascadia first. Warning. All colonists are urged to reconsider travel to Cascadia due to infestation of mantasaurs and risk of indefinite <laughs> Look detention her eyes. of death. <laughs> Any people live in Cascadia aside from marauders? There are no people aside from marauders in Cascadia. There is only death. Oh, wow. What's the local report? The local report is that you will very likely die if you leave Cascadia's landing pad. Oh my god. Sounds dangerous. This is one of those times where you say one word but really mean another, isn't it? I suppose you would find an environment like this fun. Well, you never know, Ada. No need to be a stick in the mud there, darling. Let's see here. Uh, great, that's all I need to know. Thanks, Ada. Alrighty, so apparently we're going to a very dangerous place. Uh, so who better to take with us than transitioning? Who cares? Let's go. Who to take with us for a very dangerous place? I'm thinking Sam, and I'm thinking Felix. Let's uh, let's see how this goes. Well, this doesn't look so bad. Warning, dangerous, Cascadia Big, landing pad. Wild, untamed, danger lurking around every corner. Monarch is everything I imagined. This unit is not insured. Oh. Oh, no, not you too, Sam. Or right, let's take a look at the general real quick. If I were to hit, that's Radio Free Monarch, which I assume is nearby-ish. Is it? Hold on, where's the 120, oh, 1,252 meters away. Okay. 
And the other one is the Empty Man. And that is where? That is, okay, so that's over a uh, um, thousand meters away as well. All right, guys. Let's see what we can do. I'm going to take out this miniature gun. Let's get something a little more awesome. Ooh, plasma launcher. Uh, did I? I don't know if I had a plasma launcher before. But let's take it up there. Let's see what we can get out of it. Uh, oh, this looks impressive. Let's see. All right, people. We're going on this very dangerous, very dangerous mission. Heads up, boss! Nice job, Sammy boy. Oh, Sammy boy. Yeah, trooper armor. Nice. Okay, we will oh, we'll take a look at that armor later. But for now, let's walk. Let's get on out of here. I don't think we need to look at any of this. Well, I'm, wait a minute. I'm not doing Vicar Max's quest because he's not with me. Let's do the Radio Free Monarch. No. Shall we? Heads up! Showered with pleasure. Is this thing not dying? Die, you bastard! Yeah! That's Man. what you get! Kill a mega creature. This is a mega. Whoa, whoa. Get out of here, you craziness. What's killing you, boys? Nice. You alright there, buddy? You know, I think I got a weapon for you. Hold on. Let me see here. Uh, Felix got this level 10 weapon. This is a level 15. Let's see. Let's give you that one. Let's see how that plays out. Just take a look. Ooh, let's take a look at some goodies. All right. We must have the loot. We must have the loot. The loot is very, very, very important. Alrighty, so, um... What do we... I'm guessing we have a bit of a hike, don't we? Is this... Oh, there's a door over there. Don't mind me, people. You have to check... Have to check the loot. Have to do it. What do we have here? Wildlife examination report. A report ran by Rizzo Wildlife Specialist regarding Project Terra. It lists concerns that the higher than average volume of terror ray corpses may be attracting local wildlife. Combined with the alluring purpleberry aroma coming from the Cascadia bottling plant, the engineer worries that raptodons may be encroaching ever closer to the walls. Though the walls are theoretically sound, the engineer warns that they relatively sh they are relatively shallow, and that particularly clever raptodons could possibly dig beneath them or find their way into the chemical waste pipes. Wow, it's like Jurassic Park all over again. Let's see here, cameras? No. Oh. Let us get some items. Oh, Sammy boy, the pipes. The pipes. All right, all right, all right, all right. We're good. Let's go. We want the loot. Evicted. Come on, Sam. You know we gotta check for loot. You know we gotta check for loot. Well, this guy's got nothing. Evicted. Wow, this place looks pretty beat. Whoa! Critters, Manta Queen! Oh, man. That's going to be aggressive. Can we take her on? Screw it. Let's do it. Let's take her on. Here they come. Make it dirty. Marker will help. Come 
Nice! Look, oh, what is up with that dude over there? Sanitation and maintenance job Nice. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop. Why are you jiggling? Why are you jiggling? Wiggle it just a little bit. Oh, yeah. Manti plasma gland. Nice. Man, this, this weapon is pretty powerful. Man, if these things thought they were dangerous, they must not realize that the real danger just got here. Tell them, Sam. Man, you gonna leave me holding there, Sam? Whoa, 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 whoa. What am I hearing? What am I hearing? Dirt oh. alert! Dirt alert! <laughs> dirt alert! Tell them, Sam! Man, we do not like dirt, do we, Sam? Whoa, 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 what? What? What, what is hitting me? What was hitting me? What was it? Oh. Smack him, dude. Man, hit him with that thing. Nice job. All right. Oh, nice. Well, not exactly the greatest showman soundtrack, but hey, it's all good. Picking up some bits. Some, ooh, some kind of pistola. Mm, got some goodies here. Alright, let's take a look. Nothing there. Nothing here. Anything exciting going on here? What is this thing? Oh, I'm dying. Let me uh, take a hit of the thing here. Oh, I can't open this door. Why? Oh. Space's Choice found a new flaw in you. Really? Drug addiction! Oh dear. Taking as many drugs as you have has turned into an addiction, making you suffer withdrawal if you go too long without another hit. Effects. Drug addiction withdrawal. Dexterity minus one. Perception minus one. Temperament minus one. Let's do that. I'll, I'll, I can, I can, I can hack that. I can do it. Let's take another perk point. Uh, when do I lock? It requires ten previous perks. Really? How many do I have? Two? Five? Six, seven, eight. I need two more perks to unlock the tier, the second tier here. Which all interactable objects around you highlight without it requiring you to look at that. Oh, yeah. Let's 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 take that. That sounds awesome. Okay. The journal says what? Why do? Why is the journal? Oh, the codex. Oh, okay. Fine. The codex is doing codex things. Cool. Let's see what else we can find here. Oh. We want the loot. We want it. Okay. Oh. Terminal time. Access general entries. This terminal is a sole property of Blackwood Z. Access by any person other than Blackwood Z is unauthorized. Consult your Rizzo employee handbook for the fines corresponding to unauthorized access of personal use terminals. Okay, April 27th, uh, Rizzo, Rizzo's candy has been scientifically proven to not give cavities. Five out of five Rizzo company doctors agree, <laughs> based on the average lifespan of colonists, it's the asterisk. Error, centralized storage offline, the latest four entries are available now. Okay. Alright, something stinks about these evac prep procedures. I know the tarot's were expensive, but shipping them out of here isn't going to be easy. Even the hunters are recommending that we let them loose outside the gates. I don't get why we're taking them with us anyway. Someone up the chain must really believe in the project. April 28th. I'm copying my meeting notes for posterity. Still, I still can't shake this feeling that they're hiding something. Town meeting, town meeting 428. Sumner, call the meeting to discuss preparations for our imminent departure. Pauline, platitudes, assurances that nobody is being fired. Pauline, explains that jobs await us all on Terra. Pauline, more platitudes, top management is very pleased with the proper with the project Terra and wants to ensure its assets are preserved. C. McClure, so the project isn't being scuttled? Sumner, no, just moved off Terra 1. Violet, but how will we transport the taros? Ted, hunters will assist us in safety moving them onto the shuttle. 
violent. It was hard enough getting them into the cages in the first place. Me. What about the Raptodons? We've seen more and more around town. Sumner. Assurances that the Raptodons are not interested in the Taros. Me. But the hunters are saying, no more about the Taros, Sumner says. Floor is now open to general questions. M. Cicero. How many shuttles are, coming, are incoming? Pauline. We don't know. At least one. Me. One isn't enough. For all of us, plus the damn Taros. Sumner. Let's worry about that when the evac arrives. Sumner looks... Sumner. Looks like we're out of time. Thanks for coming, everyone, and keep up the great work. Turn to root. Hmm. May 4th. We're fucked. Shuttle landed on the pad. We started moving tarot cages. Some of them broke. Birds everywhere. Talons everywhere. Even the clipped ones. Turns out they can run. Who knew? Then the raps got in. I don't know how. Must be a hole in the wall somewhere. Maybe they can dig. Fuck. They were all over the tarot at first and then us. Sumner and the other upper management were already on the shuttle. Raps got near the pad. Someone panicked. They left us. Void take their black hearts. They left us. Oof. May 7th. Got a few got a few homes stabilized, but isn't going to last. Raps everywhere. They caught scent of what's in the bottling plant, and now they're nesting. We need to move. Going to have to book it south across the bridge. Cordon off half the town. I've been trying to hail corporate, but none of my messages are getting through. I don't think help is coming. Cecile insists corporate wouldn't abandon us, but I saw that shuttle. There wasn't enough room for us and the birds. Someone up there made a decision, and it wasn't for our well-being. Rotten bastards. I make it out of this mess. I'm coming for them. Man. It's crazy stuff going on here, folks. Whew. What? Can I not get up here? What's what's the... Oh, yes, I... Can I... Oh, it's evicted. Okay. So I can't get up there. All right. Interesting. These companies, I tell you. Bad people out here. What's this? The constable. Oh. Oh, it's barred. All right. It's looks like... It's a mess. Eyes up, boss. <laughs> We're rambling into the jaws of danger. Well, let's do it. It wouldn't be us if we weren't rambling. You know what this game needs? This game needs like that guy on the radio from Fallout. The, the, the radio is constantly just telling things about what's going on. Alright, so we got some critters down here. Let's mantle clean it up. Let's, uh, let's break it down. Oh my goodness. How many of these things are here? Let's kill it. Kill it. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Oh. Continue. I, I, I was not paying attention. I was not paying attention to my, to my life. That's what happens. That's what happens. Alrighty, let us go. Job assessment. It's a mess. <laughs> well, thank you boss. for that assessment, Sam. We're rambling into the jaws of danger. Oh, thank you for that, Felix. We are trying. Let's see here. Mm -hmm. All right. So if I stop moving. Area assessment. <laughs> Useless. <laughs> Nobody messes with you, boss. Come on, kill this freaking thing. What do we got? What else we got? What's that? What is that guy doing over there? Oh, it was too far away. Good news, customer. All germs and contaminants have been neutralized. Oh, thank you, Sam. You are such awesome. You're so awesome. You're such the coolest. You're the coolest one. Coolest one. No, no. No, okay. You're just the coolest. All right, let's um, 
Let's see what else we oh let's uh let's reload, shall we? Let us reload. Let's see here. <laughs> Body bag required, eh? Is there something attacking me that's not this? Oh, there's another freaking critter over there. Oh, damn. We got ambushed. Damn critters ambushed us. All right, Sam, my boy. Let us go. Ooh. Let's see here. These baddies seem to be right in... Oh, wow, look at... Let's take a look at this. Oh, very nice. Yeah, all these monsters seem to be right on the street for some reason. So, let's just avoid the street. <laughs> Until we can't avoid it. So let's let's go for a bit of a jog. A stroll, if you will. A brisk walk across the plains. Do we have any critters here? Nothing? Uh, no. Uh, woo! Critter. Critter's coming. Critter is coming. Heads up! Easy. Easy. Let's settle down, people. Let's settle down, people. Get him, Sam! Ugh! Mega Raptodon! Oh, no! Not the Mega Raptodon! Sam! Get him! Get him! Drop kick him! Sam, do your do your move! Do it! Get up there! Smack him in the face! Bust him out! Nice job, Sammy, my boy! Oh, that's not what I wanted to do, but it's all good. Is he dead yet? Die, please. All right, he is dead. What else we got going on? Get it off! Get it off! Get it off! Smack him, Felix, man! Nice job. Let's go to the mega dude. See what is left on his carcass. Oh, has he disappeared? I guess so. Yeah, we're not messing with you, Manda Queen. You can just stay over there chilling. Yeah, I don't know where his body is. He must have, um... I don't know. Must have collapsed somewhere? I, mean, I don't know where he is. I don't know where he went. Oh! Is that... No. You, you are trying to be fresh. Let's go. Alright, we are on the move. Ooh. That thing is alive or what? Huh? Guess not. Let us reload. Reload! Oof. Can we avoid these things by coming this way? Whoa. Oh. Huh. Okay. Cool. Whoa. We got some critters down there. Don't seem very helpful. Whoa, critters over here. Just looking around to see if there's anything here. It's about to kill us. All right, let's get the loot. Really? Really? I don't have a. I guess I used them all up, huh? I don't know. All right, let's um, let's be mindful of the critters out here. Where is uh? This is where I'm supposed to go. Ooh, we got plenty of critters. Oh no 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 no! Here we go. We got a critter right over here. Let's get them just to ourselves. We don't want 50 of these bastards coming at us. All right. Let's see what do we got here? Do I it's have up, anything? boss. 
Oh, this is not a bad weapon for these guys. Clean up the competition, dude. I can't. I can't see the. Is there a guy behind me? I can't see the. Uh... I can't see the monsters. Oh, there's a raptor on right over there. Opened up a hornet's nest for these bad boys. Yeah. Anybody still alive? This area has been Thank you, Sam. Man, you're such a good sanitation worker, Sam. I gotta tell you. What? What? Put a little ointment on it. He should be okay. He should, anyway. I don't know. Okay, more death to raptodons. Yet even more death to raptodons. Man, what do we got over here? Let's see. You ever want to hide a body? You can dump it in that sulfur pool. Really? That's good to know. Thank you. How's my, um... I don't know. My, my ammo is okay. I mean, not my, uh... I'm not over in cover anyway. I just don't want to run. Because I don't want to run across any critters. Ooh, do not fall in there, Sam. Don't do it! I know you want to take a swim, but don't do it, Sam. Don't do it. You gotta make sure Sam... He's a, he's a, he's a curious sort, that Sam old... My, that Samwise Ganji... Hit that right, Sam? No, Sam, no. I can't. Really? I can't get over this stupid thing? Come on. What are you saying? Okay. Looks like we are back in it. And I think the good news is that once we get over here. We can just... I think we can call our ship. The last place we were in, there was a, com a computer terminal that said that I could call my ship over for some money or something. I don't know. I could be wrong, though. That was in Scylla? Yeah, in Scylla. Oh, oh, okay. Let's back up. Let's back up. I'm hearing things. I'm hearing things. Back up a little like bit. like we're doing this. We are. Oh my. Seriously, dudes. Seriously. You just had to go there. Nice pants. That was fun. Let's do it again. Uh, Kill it, Sam. Come on. Oh, that's the last of him. Nice. Got anything to, uh. Oh, look at this guy. La muerte. No. No, 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 no. What? Give it to me. What? <coughs> Excuse me. All right. So let's uh, let's go take a look at the carcass over here. All right. Okay. Some critters over there. What's over here? No. We're only 500 meters away. What's down here? Anything of note? Oh, there's a robot down there. Oh, there's a robot and some dudes and marauders. All right, we may have to come down this way for a quest anyway, so let's uh, let's just get back up to the Nayoka. I think we're almost there, folks. Let's, uh, let's get, ooh. What's, uh, what's, ooh. I say we get in here and here come. beat this thing up. Kill the germ, Sam. Felix. Yeah. Man, this is a good team to take with you when you're, uh, killing off a whole bunch of baddies. 
Okay, let's see what we got in here. Because we want Zalutz. Transition to Terra 1 Publications. Hmm. This looks like it's a quest destination. Let me, uh... Let's leave that there for now. We, we can... Well, no, we can go in and I think we can just warp back here later. If need be. Let's just pop in here real quick. Okay. Oh, there's a little... What's this about? Final notice. Schuster. C. To whom it may concern, I, Caden Schuster, do hereby declare my official resignation. Resignation. Delivery services to the Terra 1 printing facility 0D2214 shall cease forthwith. During my tenure of service, I have made known numerous complaints regarding the hazardous the hazards of working on this law forsaken rock, including but not limited to 1. The infestation of unknown insects in my sinus cavities, resulting in weeks of unpaid leave. 2. The as yet unreimbursed loss of several articles of clothing due to the acidic properties of the local atmosphere. 3. The constant unrelenting aggression for local wildlife. 4. A persistent itching and coughing uh, malady in my lungs, likely due to breathing in, breathing in trace amounts of sulfur. 5. Equally persistent indigestion, a symptom of an overall nutritional problem stemming from the fact that I am, in fact, allergic to fish, which is the main diet provided to service workers based in Stellar Bay. I have received the following responses to these complaints, all of which I deem unacceptable. 1. At my resulting loss of olfactory senses, I was deemed, quote, lucky to no longer suffer the stench of fish and sulfur. 2. My wardrobe was replaced with uniforms out of Stellar Bay, which suffered the exact same degradation, and I was thus no better off. 3. At my insistence, I was awarded the services of a local hunter, one N. Ramnarim Wentworth, who spent the entire service uh, who spent the entire service call inebriated and of offering and 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 offending my sensibilities with off color language. Four, after a thorough medical examination, I was found to be in working health, which was deemed more fortunate than many. Five, at my insistence that additional dietary needs be offered, I was instead awarded extra supplies of toilet paper. After this latest response, I hereby tell whoever is reading this to go on, to go hang themselves, and that your replacement rollers, ink carts, belting, bindings, key stamps, lubricants, and whatever else is in these infernal boxes can all be found rotting in the wilderness. Good day to you. Sincerely, Caden Schuster. Wow. Clearly, dude had some grievances. All right. Let's uh, sell whatever junk we have. Very nice. Back away. So is this it? This is the entire place? Well, I'm not going to go in here because I'm sure that's for a quest. All right, let's uh, let's transition to Monarch and see if we can just get to the to the place before the time runs out. Alrighty, so we have 400 meters to go. Let's see if we can get there in one piece. I shall come back and loot all of you later. But I am running out of time. And I want to at least get to Monarch, or Stellar Bay rather, if possible. Great, we have a Raptor on Colossus. Just, just here. Just chilling. And we cannot outrun him. Can we? No, we cannot. Can we just scoot down and be somewhat... Uh... Can you see me? Please don't see me. Please don't see me. Damn you! You saw me! Alright. Whoa! We got ourselves a little place here we can hide out. Possibly. Wow! No! 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 The, let's run, people! Let's run for it! Run for your lives! Run for your lives! Right, let's see how many we got. Okay, quite a few. Quite a few. But at least we got a bit of a choke point here. We can hold them off. You make a journey, Sam cleans it up. Ah! 
die. Look at look at the way look at the way it's going. The ball's gone. I'm with. All right. So I think all in all that was not a terrible idea. We survived, right? Ish. Well, I don't know where Sam is, but I assume if I keep on walking here, you guys will definitely respawn. Unless I'm going the wrong way, which is of course quite possible. Am I going the wrong way? Hmm. I don't know. Oh, Raptorons. Maybe this is the right way. Or maybe not. Oh, what's up, Felix? Maybe that looks like a looks like some kind of bridge over there. Let's let's take that bit. Let's see where that takes us. Jackass is incoming. Yeah? Where? Oh, hello. Hello, sir. How are you today? Well, I take it. No? Are you still not dead? Die, please. Thank you. Oh, oh. No, 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 no. No, no. You must be nice. You must be nice to people. You can't be just doing this kind of stuff. What's wrong with you? Anybody else? Oh, more people. Okay. We got ourselves a little fan club here. A raptor on. Me trying to be, you know. Whoa, whoa, get out of the goo, get out of the goo. The goo can't be good, can it? Oh, that's the last of them. Man, we are just killing these raptodons. Let's go, boys. Okay, something weird just happened here. Give me a second here. Let me just get this working. Okay, all right, we're, we're back in it. Back in it to win it. All right. Whoa, whoa, what's, 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 what's doing whatever that's, what's doing that to me? Oh, okay. So we got those fools over there. It's your vomit. Nobody likes your vomit. Nobody likes it. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Die. All right, let's go. Let's get in here. Rising. Concentrated amount of scum present ahead. We gotta go exploring. Oh. I wanna see some savages. I bet you do, you freakazoid. But for right now, let's just get inside. Let's get into Stellar Bay. Let's be let's get the ability to able to um fast travel here. And then I'm just gonna call it. I got to level 15, people. Absolutely fantastic. All right, so I'm going to leave it there for now, folks. Thank you all very much for watching. Um, my name's Abe. I'll catch you on the next one. Bye for now.